All right, Hooker Grove family, I hope that you are doing fabulous on this Tuesday. It is week two, day two, online learning, and I got my buddy with me, Dom. A lot of you guys know bro Dom. Um, he has a way of making himself known around the school because you are big and strong and amazing, and I love you, bro. And i uh, so thankful that we are, have this time together, uh, but looking forward to being back with uh, our family, our Hooker Grove family soon. Uh, thumbs up. That's right. Um couple announcements, students below, you'll see a fitness challenge coming out. Um, that starts tomorrow. Coach Rhodes has put that together with us. I'm participating. My wife's participating. Dom's probably going to participate. Aren't you, Dom? Yeah. Got to stay healthy. Got to stay fit during this time. I uh, want to honor the Lord with how we take care of ourselves and to keep moving. Uh, no one wants to emerge from quarantine looking 20 pounds heavier. Um, I know the refrigerator is close by to where I work, which is not a good thing uh, right now at my kitchen table. So I want to make sure that uh, we are staying active. All right, students, want to share with you one other thing coming out of the uh, Hebrews 10.23, our verse for the year. We decided on this verse back in July. Dr. Questenberry and myself sat down and decided, what, what do we want our theme to be? And so you've heard of this, hold fast to the Lord. Um, but I want to read uh, verse 23, 24, and 25, and really focus on 24 and 25 today. So Hebrews 10, 23 says this, Let us hold fast the confession of our hope without wavering, for he who promised is faithful. Verse 24, And let us consider how to stir up one another to love and good works, not neglecting to meet together as the habit of some, but encouraging one another, and all the more as you see the day drawing near. Um, students, if you look at verse 24 and 25, this idea of encouraging one another, stirring one another up for good works. I want you to encourage your classmates. I want you to encourage your families. I want you to be uh, the student that Hickory Grove has really invested in you to become, and that is an encourager, one that holds fast to the Lord Jesus during this time, that does not waver, but also um, comes alongside of people and helps and serves and encourages. And so I hope that this uh, these announcements and this newsletter finds you well this morning. Um, let me know if there's anything I can do to help you or serve you in any way. And so we are out of here, aren't we, Dom? Yes. Can you say peace out? Peace out. Yeah, see you guys.